Thank you, Madam Speaker, Deputy Speaker. This morning, union protesters rallied outside my office against the China Free Trade Agreement. I want to set for the record. I want to set the record straight on what the agreement means to the people of Flynn. The agreement will not reduce immigration safeguards. It will not permit overseas workers to work in Australia without going through the necessary checks. Australia is not bound to agree to quest from the Chinese companies for concessions to the standard visa requirements. The, this FTA is similar to previous labour agreement programs in place by the former Labor government. This FTA also includes labour mobility outcomes consistent with Australian current immigration policy. We are not changing the required skills level for Chinese visas, visa holders to work in Australia. We are streamlining and improving access to skills assessment. We are doing this to provide and improve trade relationships between Australia and China, to encourage investment into Australia, to reduce tariffs on industries including tourism, agriculture and the energy and resource sector. I am confident that these outcomes will benefit my constituents and we need to support further investments in our industries. 